I have to say, it's a real honor to accompany such a brave and distinguished knight. None other than Catherine, wielder of Thunderbrand. You mean you don't know? My weapon is called Thunderbrand. It's one of the hero's relics. A long, long time ago, the goddess bestowed divine weapons upon ten heroes, which were passed down to their descendants. It's an honor to wield, but I'm afraid there won't be any chance for that today. Our mission is to help clean up the aftermath, not to fight. Why would Lenato incite such a reckless rebellion? You should know more about that than any of us, Ash. Well, I don't. Lenato never mentioned anything of the like to me. He probably didn't want you getting caught up in his own personal vendetta. I'm Lenato's adopted son. He raised me as though I were his own blood. He was always so kind. I don't understand. <sighs> I guess it has to do with Kristoff. How much do you know about the tragedy of Dusker, Professor? It's when the king of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus was... was murdered by the people of Dusker. It happened about four years ago. It's okay, Catherine. Please. Go on. Right. Well, Lord Lenato's son, Kristoff, was accused of being involved in that whole awful affair. He was executed by the church. King Lambert was attempting a major political reform. Needless to say, he had many enemies. Whatever the truth behind that incident may be, Lord Lenato has harbored resentment toward the church ever since. Well, to be more specific, his grudge isn't only against the church. It's also against the one who turned Kristoff over to them. Report! The enemy is approaching. They can't be avoided. Their numbers are far greater than we predicted. They use the fog to slip past the knight's perimeter. It looks like our mission just changed, Professor. Everyone, prepare for battle! Thank you very much. Thanks so much! I have gratitude. With this fog, it's impossible to tell where the enemy might be, or how many of them there are. The enemy could be trying to surround us, but they shouldn't have enough soldiers to form a tight circle. Take down anyone who breaks through the fog, and let's push through! Shouting from within the fog. It seems the knights are already battling. Proceed with caution. Wait for them to enter your field of view. I'll cut through.
Ready. I don't care. Stay focused. I'll give it my all. I will get the victory. I'm on it. What should I do? Here goes. Here we go. You think we're just gonna do nothing while you try to kill our lord? Why, Lenato? Why did you drag so many others into this? Saw that coming. to is Catherine. Prepare to taste the blade of one who serves the goddess. Now you face a knight of Theros! The fog is cleared. There's nothing left to hide you or the filthy central church from the judgment of the goddess.
Appreciate it. the one to kill you no other you have lost all sense of justice you want to fight me so be it I'll send you to meet your goddess Monato, I have no wish to kill you, but I'm afraid you have left me no choice. Your Highness, I cannot stop here. For my child, and for the people of Fodlan. If you will not stand aside, then I have no choice but to cut you down. Thank you. 
Thank you. Deceived by that witch! We'll lend you a hand. Lenato, I... I never thought I'd see Lenato meet this fate. Well done, everyone. Let's gather our troops and go. Why did this happen? Lenato was always such a kind man. Everyone in the village was... was so nice to me, and I... I killed them. I, I killed them all. I had to. I know I had to. I know that, but still... I... What does that make me? Please, don't beat yourself up, Ash. We did what had to be done. I'm... I'm sorry. I shouldn't be bothering you. I'm... I'm going to check on the town. I hope my brother and sister are okay. That... That was my first time killing civilians, too. Those who I'm sworn to protect. Are you insane? Those weren't knights or soldiers, but fathers and sons! We... We shouldn't have killed them. We should have found another way. I... I'm sorry. It's not fair for me to blame you for the circumstance. I know that if we hadn't done what we did, even more civilian lives would have been lost. At least my mind understands that, but... my heart... <laughs> Professor, those in power, no matter the era, always claim they fight for a just cause, that they take life to protect it. But is it truly okay to take any life you please, all in service of some implacable just cause? Lord Lenato didn't take up arms out of a lust for power. He simply believed his cause to be just. Who's to say it wasn't? Maybe we didn't have to cut him down like that. Maybe we could have reached a mutual understanding, found a path of peace. I... I have to believe that. Perhaps the notion sounds laughable to you. Mere lip service to naive ideals. But I can't believe otherwise. Sorry to intrude, but this incident may be more serious than anticipated. I found this on Lord Lenato. It's a note that mentions a plan to assassinate Lady Rhea. We can't tell who sent it, so the source is suspect. But the content is too disturbing to ignore. We must report this to Lady Rhea right away. I hope that it's nothing. So, our task for this moon is to patrol and guard the monastery to help put a stop to that assassination plot. 
The knights will certainly have their hands full protecting Lady Rhea. And perhaps our enemy is counting on that. Your Highness, I am curious as to what you mean by that. Why would Lord Lenato be carrying around a secret note with an assassination plot written on it? Isn't it possible he hoped to monopolize everyone's attention with this alleged plot in order to distract from his true aim? Maybe they're after the treasure vault. <gasps> There's also lots of valuable stuff in the library and Professor Hanneman's quarters. True. The monastery undoubtedly houses many weapons that rival even the hero's relics. Whatever their aim, we can't allow any harm to come to the ladies of the monastery. I mean, what would I do with my spare time? You mean to say we should search the monastery, try to find what the enemy is truly after? Yes. And we should be prepared to fight them as well, should it come to that. I wouldn't mind getting in some training, just in case. A secret meeting, Professor? Oh, we haven't been introduced. I am Shamir. Shamir is one of the Knights of Seros, and this young man here is... I work for Lady Rhea, and I'm Shamir's apprentice. Oh, the name's Cyril. Yep, I help Lady Rhea with all kinds of stuff. I've got to protect Lady Rhea, so that's why I've got to learn all I can from Shamir. Cyril adores Rhea. That aside, if you need anything, ask. something the stone within the sword a glow of red hmm? oh it is nothing Spend too much time roaming the monastery. If you're looking for something, try less aimless wandering. Do you even know who the enemy is? It's none of my business anyway. I Terrible if the greenhouse was targeted. The plants in here are incredibly valuable. This place contains the heart of Garrick Mach's 995 year history. So many beautiful flowers, plants that can save or end lives. They are all my precious children. Another win. 
Another win. You're weak. Next time, bring your friend. I'm glad I asked you. Setting fire to the stables to distract everyone, to cause a commotion. It is the oldest trick in the book, but I cannot shake the thought that our enemies may attempt it. I will stand guard and watch over the stable, and the knight's horses. They are truly magnificent. Please, do me a favor. of students wandering the monastery late at night. They wouldn't happen to be from your class, would they? Please keep your students in line, Professor. Kids these days. I like this. I would be liking that greatly. Professor, I am not understanding where the meaning is here. When and how is this expression used? I fell for it. No, that is what you say when you meet the mate of your soul. The expression is, I fell for it. Thank you, Professor. I finally have understanding. Can I ask you about another word? The one that is written here. Mm hmm? Is something on my face? I am without much time to study. I must use my time with wisdom. Is that really what you are thinking? 
Or maybe you have curiosity about the mark on my face. You are already knowing that I am from Bridget. This is a mark from Bridget. It is a prayer to the forest spirits. A prayer to be protected. Hunters ask the forest spirits to have safe and bountiful hunting. There are many spirits in Bridget. I have more marks on my arms and back. They are prayers for my family's health and triumph. Are you wanting to see them? That gives me happiness. I will be showing them to you soon. I have much gratitude for you, Professor. You always listen with patience. I can read and understand the language of Foglin, but to speak it... Uh, gives me difficulty. I hope I will keep having your support. And I will give you my support, too, with my whole heart. I have things that I cannot fail to accomplish. Yes, we will keep walking forward. Let's see. Thanks for your help. So, there is something that the church values above all else. On the day of the rite, it will be open to the public. That will make gaining entry far easier than usual. You know the place of which I speak. Yes, that is the most likely possibility. We do not know their objective, but there is a good chance that our enemy is planning to target the Holy Mausoleum. We don't know who are in Thank you. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you. Mm, it's a bit hot. Yes. Thinking of my next meal. Yes. Delicious. Thank you for the treat. I had such a great time.
Thank you for sparring with me, your highness. It seems despite how hard I've worked, I'm still no match for you. Oh, there's no need for such humility. Thanks to all of your hard work, you're improving rapidly. If you're going to praise me, it should at least be after I've won a match against you. You know, Ingrid, I may be the victor when we cross spears on foot like this. But on horseback, your handling of a lance is far superior. Can't I be allowed to have my own area of expertise? No, I cannot allow that. It's my duty to get stronger, to fight with all I have in defense of the kingdom and its people. Such high stakes. <laughs> By the way, where did you learn that fierce jab of yours? I'm pretty sure the only other person I've seen perform that move is Glenn. So you recognized it? Yes, he shared much with me. I thought as much. I never imagined I would be on the receiving end of one of his techniques again. Glenn and I once studied under the same instructor. I've sparred with him more times than I can count. Ah, uh, yes. He was never short on praise for you. Lord Dimitri is incredible. Such skill. There's no way I'll ever outmatch him. Things of that sort. Well, now, he never said any of that to me. Well, he was Felix's brother. That family's not big on displays of affection. That is true. We spent about as much time arguing as we did training. I can't believe it's been four years since the tragedy of Dusker. Since we lost Glenn along with so many others. So it has. Time moves quickly. Things have changed so much. Despite the sorrow, I intend to become a powerful knight. A knight like yourself. And like Glenn. I will do so for the sake of my homeland, the Holy Kingdom of Fargus, and for all who have died protecting it. To that end, I hope you will spar with me again in the future, Your Highness. It would be my pleasure. After all, I value our training sessions as much as you do. This could be useful. Quite intrigued. Quite intrigued. Of course I get This could be useful. I thought... 
All right, that's it. Looks like I... Ah, no big deal. I must ask you. That can't be. Regardless of the quality, this is a good chance for us to prove our solidarity. Singing in tune with others proved quite difficult. I'm getting the hang of this. 